Now, on top of that, we learn that the Liberal government has given 30 times more money in contracts to the Liberal-linked firm McKinsey than did the, pre or the prior Conservative government. Recent reporting has shown the company, neither the company nor the government, is willing to explain what the money was for. $66 million in core government contracts and tens of millions of dollars of other contracts from Crown corporations. One unnamed immigration public servant said that he or she did not even know what they got for the money. $25 million went to that department. And what did we get as Canadians? What are the results of this management company's ingenious work? So we want to know what all this money was for. We also want to know about the outsized influence of this company in the operation of our government and our democracy. The company is under investigation for its involvement in politics and government in France. They've had to pay financial penalties for their role in facilitating the sale of opioids into the United States of America that helped deliver a massive um, drug overdose crisis that is now spread into Canada. And then finally, the, C, the director, uh, former director of this company, managed to get himself uh, the gig as our ambassador to China. So it's time for Canadians to get answers. We need to know what this money was for, what influence McKinsey has had in our government. And it is time for Canadian taxpayers to have answers to these questions. A Polyev government will bring answers and bring accountability. We will spend dollars to deliver good services to, to Canadian citizens who pay for them, not to give juicy contracts to powerful multinationals. And we will give Canadians back control of their lives and their government by ensuring that it is Canadians through their elected officials that make accountable decisions not powerful multinationals with their own agendas, imposing them on uh, government decision makers.